Hi, this is Kim with Mom's Creative Moments. Welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing a product reveal or what I'm calling a product reveal. Um, our new baby collection has just launched and it is super fun and really amazing but there are a lot of different components to it so I thought it might be fun and interesting to go ahead and kind of introduce you to it in the spirit of a gender reveal kind of thing. I thought it might be fun to just call it a reveal today <laughs> of these new products. If you'd like to see these products online, go to my website. It'll be listed in the details of this video. In the search box, type in Welcome Baby and all the products that go along with this, except for the Border Maker cartridge, except for the Border Maker cartridge that we're going to talk about will come up and be easily accessible. If you'd like to find the Border Maker cartridge, just type in bears to that search box and it should come up for you. Let's check out my workspace and we'll get started. All right, I, this is kind of new for me doing uh, project reviews, but I just wanted to share with you the new baby collection. This is planned to be available for the next two years and so that's a long time but this collection has so many elements to it it's really rather remarkable so I wanted to just share it with you real quick first of all you have the main designer paper pack which is this one and it's done in these beautiful colors the canary yellow the island waters and the deep sea green along with beige and white this is meant to be a, a neutral palette so that you can augment this with one of the mini paper packs that is blue or purple. Everything that is in this collection is designed to go together, but if you want to make your album a little bit lean towards blue or lean towards purple, you can do that. The, you'll, you'll see I'm going to open up the map packs and the pictures and the embellishments. We're going to take a look at all of it and I haven't actually seen it up close. I did open these two paper packs so that I could flip through them for you but other than that I haven't seen them until now uh, other than on videos. So there is this really nice wood pattern. It is a little bit, I don't want to say it's cartoony because that's not really what I mean but it's not really meant to be a realistic wood pattern, but it is an, a nice kind of flowing wood, woody pattern. Then you have these cute bunnies. You also have this nice pinstripe, which has multiple colors in it, if you can see that. Let's see if I can focus that better for you so you can see it. There we go. That's better. And then this beautiful star paper that is kind of a combination of the island waters and the, the dark sea green. And then we've got this nice plaid that's also a combination of island waters and dark sea green. And this really nice yellow stripe. I love this paper right here. All the little alphabet blocks are so cute and very perfect for a nursery and toddler years. And then there's a nice neutral block. Then there are these yellow, look like roses or possibly, I'm trying to remember what the name of it, that flower is. Anyway, it's nice. This is more of the island waters color, leafy pattern, and then the cute little geese ducks and geese and this is another neutral pattern so that makes up your basic um, paper pack the designer paper pack the one that is meant to be kind of the core of this collection then you have your purple and blue packs and these packs have exactly the same patterns in them so whether you choose blue or choose purple you're going to see the same patterns in your paper. You're going to see this kind of archy, multiple arches pattern, this nice stripe with a varied line. You've seen this pattern before. We've used this in other papers, but this is just a very nice neutral. The ombre, which is my favorite. 
and this really pretty cloud paper here along with a little bit more plaid and this plaid is more in the baby blue or blue shades than uh, the plaid that you get in the designer paper pack. Same thing with the lavender paper pack. The shades in here are going to be similar to the purple ice and eggplant cardstock colors, which match. Then we get this really cute die cut paper pack that I've been excited to open, but I have not opened yet. So I'm going to open it and show you. This is perfect if you want to do kind of a year at a glance. The green side actually is labeled so that you could take a picture each month and put it in here and be able to see the progression of baby all the way to their first year. So that part is neat. If that doesn't appeal to you or you're not inclined to do that, you can flip it over and use this side, which also coincidentally would be perfect in a back to school album. You could use this and put a picture of the student for every year of school. Kindergarten wouldn't fit, but that's okay. Every other grade would up to 12th grade. So definitely a multi-use type of laser cut frame. All right, so perfect for baby, but also perfect for your school age kids. Then we've got the new paper album, which when I saw this, I thought, oh, that's perfect for presenting to grandparents as a, as a, little gift what grandparent doesn't want to brag about their grandbabies right and this one is pre-printed so all you need to do is add your photos it actually comes with photo splits so you don't even need to buy adhesive it's perfect for a nice gift for somebody there's 10 pages you can fit depending on how you crop your photos you can fit between typically we say between 15 and 30 photos in this one little book depending on how you choose to crop and what size photos you want to use. So that's a lot of photos to gift to grandma and grandpa um, to keep track of their new grandbaby. There's this cute map pack which I've seen pictures of and I just wanted to get this out and take a look at it. Of course there are the two different size mats. There's the four by six mats and the four and a half by six and a half mats. And many of these have, well, of course they're all double-sided, but many of these have sweet little sayings on them. So you could use them for many different things. They can be your title on your page. You can use these for cards, thank you notes. They would make beautiful, quick, cards. You could even use them like a postcard and put a note on the back of some, some of them. Really, really cute. Sweet, sweet, sweet. This one you could cut apart and use separately with embellishments or you can use this side all by itself. So that's really cool portion of the pack. This pack, because it is the six, the four and a half by six and a half, you'll find that this breaks down into the two and a quarter by three and a quarter so that you can um, utilize this for journal boxes or you could even put a photo in there and frame it if you wanted. You can mat your photo on top of it as well super fun and you can see that it matches all the same patterns and colors Ooh, that's pretty of the um, paper pack so really really nice and if you got this and the paper album you could certainly use these smaller journal boxes as frames for smaller pictures I think that would be really cute and very quick to put together as well so score another point for the mat pack. All right, 
The tool that comes with this is a border maker cartridge and the border maker cartridge is called Bears and it makes this super cute little bear chain with hearts in the center it's like their whole their hands are holding a heart and their tummies are hollow so that's really a cute addition to your your um, page I just punched a, a blue piece behind a baby blue piece to create this cute little border I haven't actually put it together yet but um, you can see maybe the design better this way on the dark blue but definitely a fun addition to our tools we also have the sticker pack and the sticker pack works a little bit like the laser frame that we were looking at in fact it's got one month two three four all the way to 12 months so you can identify that on your page if you're if you're not going to use that frame or even if you are using that frame and then you have more photos from that age you can use these and you'll notice there are actually two different stickers so there's the one surrounding the center and then there's a a hollow piece um, I don't know how to explain that but see there's this little piece right here that you can use which makes a cute little little frame for another embellishment and then there's all these little tiny embellishments all in the gaps of this page brilliant and then this one and this one have our words cutie pie nap time snuggles don't you cry hush little baby don't you cry um, grow we made a wish and you came true I gave you life but really you gave me mine really really cute some corners you can add to photos and some other like parentheses for emphasis and then these cute 12 inch borders that um, I love this one with the with the moon with the smiley face on it that's very cute all right so those are the stickers that we have then there are these two embellishment packs welcome baby purple and welcome baby blue and I haven't actually gotten to see these so I'm gonna open up at least one of them and see all the cuteness here so we've got our you've got your um, acrylic stickers those are super cute with the ducky and the moon that moon matches the moon that's in the stickers over there you've got a place to put the date the time the inches the pounds all the pertinent information more some stars there's a little duck pacifier baby on board a bee there's a little frame for a journal box or another one or you could use those to anchor your embellishments as well we've been talking a lot about embellishing here lately and giving pieces of advice that's a looks like a stuffed duck keys what baby doesn't have keys to chew on right and there's a cute little mobile another mommy duck you can see how the colors are incorporated into this collection right so there are, you're in this collection that is the baby blue welcome baby blue you can see a lot of the island green or island waters and the blue characteristics blue feet there's a baby with bunny ears on his head their head feet God knew my heart needed you there's that the rainbow just like in that other the rainbow arch just like in the other um, 
There's Hello Cutie in a banner and a toy and some more anchors for embellishments. So really, really a fun and cute collection. I think you'd agree. Super, super fun. We don't have any babies in our family right now, but I watch a couple of little ones occasionally and they are so fun to get to know their little personalities. Reminds me of when my kids were this size. And it's fun to have a baby around again. Okay. So we've got this for Welcome Baby Blue. That's that pack. And then Welcome Baby Purple, I would suspect, has many of the same things. But let's, let's just check it out and see. Because we can. Okay, so the stickers look like they're very much the same, although we have a sunshine here instead of a moon. And then we've got many of the same anchors for borders, but maybe just a little bit more of a delicate nature. We've still got the baby on board and the ABC. We have flowers. Big Sister, Bunnies. Again, there is a, still a little bit of the Island Waters and, and Dark Sea Green, but not as much because this pack focuses on the Purple Ice and Eggplant. So that's why you get more of the emphasis of, on that. So, super cute. Many of these, like I said, are, ex are the same, like I expected that they probably would be. We may still have the geese and the mobile, and that one has a sun, which is cute. We've got a few more toys stars. Really cute. Oops. I can see I have gone out of the frame and I'm sorry about that. All right. So again, a super cute collection for baby. That is um, most of what there, what is included in this collection. And like I said before, it is meant to last for about two years. So, um, we can look forward to playing with this for quite a while and I'm excited. I think it's going to be very, very fun to, to make layouts for this and we have several friends that are expecting so that's a fun, fun, fun thing for them um, and very exciting. So I hope this has been helpful for you. I hope that maybe it will help you decide if it's going to be a collection that will help you create something special for your loved ones and whether it's for you to keep your own photos in for your baby or as a gift for someone you love I know that you'll be happy with this it's really a cute collection thanks so much for joining me until next time I hope you have many more creative moments have a great day now mm -hmm.